And here now is Grover Norquist, Americans for Tax Reform President. Well, Grover, yeah. Congressman Brady is a fine man. There's no, no mm -hmm. question about it. He knows taxes. He knows how to write tax law. But I'm wondering if his message can, can outshine, if you will, the glare of Charlottesville. Well, the good news is that we can walk and chew gum. Uh, we have to get the economy going again. Uh, we have had almost a decade now of, of 2 percent growth, French rates of economic growth rather than Reagan and American rates of economic growth. We should be at 4 percent. Uh, when we turn to go to the American people and say, uh, you've been looking at shiny things, uh, right? How about focusing on uh, a central issue of getting growth mm -hmm. for all Americans and turning the economy uh, around? Uh, that's, I think, going to make it very easy for people in the House and the Senate uh, to vote to take the corporate rate down right. as close to 15 well, as you and, can. And, and the people in the House and the Senate are moved by their constituents. They're moved by yes. the desire to get reelected. Let's face it. And yeah. if the president comes out, makes a forceful message to the American people, sells the message mm -hmm. that we want to take power away from the government and put it back in your pocket, uh, then that might move Congress. But will the president do it? Is he so preoccupied with this other stuff that he either won't have the time or the inclination mm -hmm. to do it? Well. The House can pass the, the House, the Senate, and the White House, meaning uh, Treasury Department uh, and Cohn of, of the uh, economic advisors. They've been sitting down. They have 97 percent agreement on what goes into this uh, pie. There is a question of what gets made permanent, what's going to be temporary. How do you get all the way to 15? Grover, I don't do have much time. I've got to force you on this one. The president, will yeah. the president do what Ronald Reagan did in 1981? Get on the airwaves, right. prime time, and make the sale pitch. I hope he will, but it's not necessary. This can pass the House and the Senate. We need the president's signature and his support, and, and there we have both. Big business, as you know, today is uh, more than ever shying away from the president. It may come back uh, with his agenda, but will the, the lack of lobbying power by them for the president's agenda hurt that agenda, particularly with regard to taxes? Again, this is the agenda of the House and Senate Republicans. The entire business committee, small NFIB, large business roundtable, Chamber of Commerce, they all desperately need this for their employees, their shareholders, mm -hmm. for their companies. They will be behind this 100%. And uh, again, whoever was president, this would go, was right. going to be the Republican package. Okay, final quick question. Uh, the Chairman Brady said he uh, wants to get the tax rate, corporate tax rate, as low as possible. If it's 25%, that's not low, low enough to bring companies back to the U.S., is it? Quickly. No, you need to get to 15%. Very good. That's a simple answer. Thank you. Grover Norquist, great to yep. see you, my friend. I appreciate it.